morning. I don't even really know what to say right now other than that it's been really hard lately. Um, yeah, but you know, I, I have to keep track. I, I have to keep track by video for myself so that I can remember certain things and um, I'm just, I'm just so tired. Um, and I'm not complaining, it's just, it's just a fact. And, uh, we have these inspections. I cannot believe this. <laughs> I cannot believe, every, there's, there's just humor everywhere, but it's not funny. And I, I don't know why I laugh. Maybe it's just a coping mechanism, but um, it's not funny. I have no idea what I'm going to do for detox today. My body is just screaming for body brushing. It, it, it really is literally just screaming for it. It's almost like an itch. But you need a scratch, so uh, I'm gonna wait for my kids to leave for the school, and yeah, I don't want the peroxide. I don't want it. It is so helpful, but the hurts are just so terrible. I mean. The, 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 the worst part of that terribleness is your burden on everybody else. It, it's just awful. It's just awful. I, I would give it anything just to have this kept to myself. You know? so, <laughs> I think about detox before I do it, and I shouldn't, you know, what I should be doing is distracting myself and waiting, waiting for the, the moment and just, just not think about it and just do it, that's, that's what I have to do, I don't, I don't know, I mean, With these inspections, man, how are we going to make it through? I yeah, I can barely walk. I've got tears. <laughs> you know, it, it sounds like I'm complaining, but I'm not. I'm just trying to figure it out. It's It's... You know, every day is a brand new day, and I, I see that, I see that really a lot now. I didn't see it before, but I do now. And I don't want to take my life for granted. Obviously, I have before, and... I don't even know what to say. So, uh, I I have been at the end of my rope, and I I don't have any friends. I have one friend. <laughs> I know that sounds crazy, but it's true. Well, I might have two friends, but. This one friend, a couple of days ago, saved my life. He didn't even know it. He didn't even know it. Something, something told him to take three hours of his time to come over because that's just a friend that he 
is can help bring me back to the land of reality because God knows I need it. And, you know, I mean, just little things like that can save a life. You. You, you can never know the value of you to a Lyme patient. Um, this is that's my experience of, man, the, the people that do take that time for you out of their days, um, I mean, of course there's guilt involved. And, we we also need to recognize that maybe we should feel a little guilt, even if it's not our fault. Just for people stressing out over us, and you know that I mean that's a big reflection of love, whether it's romantic love or friendship love or you know mother to daughter love or I mean there's so many kinds of love. Um, but, I mean, a person taking a bus across town and, I mean, spending three hours just to help me, that means a lot. Oh, that means so much. And he might have saved my life that day. Well, the same hell, man. Oh my goodness, I am just so tired. So tired. I I just I don't know what to do except get a get a uh a digger. I wanna say a digger. You know and Anyway, I, I'm clearly not thinking very well, and well, yeah, I, I'm gonna. Um, I have to go for the bath. I mean, I have to, and this time I need to put peroxide in it, and I need to go through hell. I just do, and of course I'm not looking forward to this. I mean, come on, who would? Who who would want? Who would want to do any of this? And, and just the nerve of um, people. I'm not talking about people in my life. I'm talking about man. <laughs> I don't even. I don't even know what to say anymore. Um, except hello to the new world order or what is going on. What is going on? And um, man, it, it it just feels like you're a test subject. It does. It, it, at least to me, I feel like I'm being in it, thrown in a test, a scientific test. It's just wrong. It's not. It's not just wrong for me. It's wrong for everybody. And there was a scientist who did get into the DNA of the Lyme spirochy, which there's several hundred of them. It's not just one. You see, memory gone. I mean, it's just crazy. It's craziness, man. <laughs> it's craziness. And. Man, the IDSA needs to come down. Can I scream it loud enough? Can it, we all scream it loud enough? The IDSA needs to come down. Take that crap down off the government CDC website. You know what you're doing. Who? <laughs> Um, who is running all this show? I'm looking at the camera right now because, man, uh, who's doing this? 
Who is who's made this? Come on, man. Who's doing this? And what are your what are your reasons? I mean, let's see. Could it be that we have over seven billion people on this planet, and it's a really good way to get a lot a lot of us gone. I just don't know what to think. Uh, maybe I shouldn't be thinking. Maybe I should just be staring at the ceiling all the time. But you know, I get sick of it. I really get sick of it. I mean, it, it just gets plain tiring and old. And you know, feeling like you're reduced to nothing. It's it's a horrible feeling. It, it really is. And anyway. That's all. That's all I so. Love you and I hope you have a good day.